Well, here we are back at Rose Cottage, and uh, we have found three of five spirits that were haunting this place, and put them to rest. There are two more. Now, I have two things here going on here. One, uh, I have the key to the cemeteries. Two, in the kitchen we found the drain control for the fountain, and I'm very curious what that did. So before I go to the cemetery, I'm going to check out the uh, fountain here. Oh, did we just turn it off? No, it opened up a passage. Hmm. If I go down there, I am not going to be coming back up the same way. That would be inconvenient. I don't think I'm quite ready to do that yet. So instead, let us go round to the cemetery. Oh, I warm myself at the fire too. It's actually a cold night and I've foolishly left all the doors open so there's drafts everywhere. Alright, cemetery. Pull us out. Just out here. Very, very small cemetery, it's a number of... Oh. Hang on. Oh, I mean, I've got a key, but... Can I not open the gates? Uh, that might be a much shorter cemetery expedition than I was expecting, you know? Oh, wait, there's a passage behind the walls here. Does this lead me anywhere? Hmm, maybe not. Uh, yeah. What's that on the ground? Oh, it's a spotlight. Okay. Well, I guess I'm not getting in here. Despite getting the cemetery key. Ooh, that's gonna make a good screenshot. Despite getting the cemetery key, I uh, apparently can't get into the cemetery. Perhaps I could jump to the wall. Hmm, seems risky and uncertain. I think not. Alright, we still have two of those fine fellows to find. Uh, I've been everywhere there. Fountain. Let us let us explore where the fountain will take me. It seems the best next way forward. It's very odd that we got the cemetery key and can't access the cemetery. But you know, children and their games. Uh, Caitlin's treasure hunt there. Uh, appears to have... Well, why does she think it's a cemetery's treasure? Maybe the cemetery is continuing their treasure hunt. There's someone new, and perhaps there is another spirit down here that we can put to rest and uh, help resolve these problems. Yeah, there's uh, passages do go on. Who built, who built these tunnels and why? So oh, the room's coming up, but it's purely a tunnel. Oh. Um. 
I see there's a uh, very large crypt. With a great many urns in it. Why would this be buried so inaccessibly? Doesn't make sense. Would you design a uh, your mortuary crypt to be so inaccessible? Perhaps this is in the cemetery. Uh, I guess that would be reasonable. There's not a ladder leading up that way. I'll check that shortly. Let's uh, just go up the stairs and see if this is indeed the crypt that we saw, or mausoleum, I suppose. Or whatever. Once again, it's uh, not the architecture and paraphernalia of the living that uh, I study, I don't know the right terms, but rather that of the dead. It is! So the cemetery key will be of use here. And I should be able to open this gate with this lever. Excellent! Excellent. Well, I can only guess that uh, there is. I can only hope that I find another one of the spirits haunting uh, this building here. Well, nothing in this alcove. I think there was a door in the other one. Indeed. Um, cemetery key lets me access it. Ah, here is the cemetery proper. That's that's much more like it. Oh, look who we have there, I think. I should go say hello. Sir, would you follow me, please? This way. This way. Let's lead this fine fellow to the chapel. I do hope I left all the doors open. Good. Oh, they're so noisy, aren't they? So very noisy. Four of the five at rest. Now, I wonder, did they actually die? Or could they still even be revived? Who knows? Surely they wouldn't, uh... The spirits wouldn't be roaming if they weren't actually dead. If they were merely sedated heavily by these, uh, drugs. I imagine what happened is, uh, the old fellow fell down the stairs there. Somehow. Knocked his head on the wall. Died of a, uh... Brain hemorrhage. And, um... These poor five thieves waiting to be revived never were. It's unfortunate. Right, before I check out the cemetery proper, I'm going to go have a look at the other ladder down here in the crypt. Uh, it's got to be... Uh... Oh, there's a couple of them. Well, I guess they're far... Just for accessing these urns. Oh, they would need to access these urns in particular, but uh, not really anything I need. Very well. Back to the cemetery. I shouldn't run everywhere, it's uh, quite undignified. I mean, yes, fair enough for me to run away from the uh, restless spirits that are trying to uh, attack me, but um, as I lead them to the chapel. But beyond that, there's no need to run. Alright, to the cemetery. I 
guess there's a lot of people being uh, buried here over the years. It's like quite an old cemetery. I wonder what I might expect to find. There sat the shadow feared of man, who broke out their companionship and spread his mantle dark and cold, unwrapped the formless in the fold, and dulled the murmur on thy lip. And bore thee where I could not see, nor follow, though I walk in haste, and think that somewhere in the waste the shadow sits and waits for me. That's a very pleasant poem. Not really the kind of thing most people would want to put on their tombstones, but uh, fair enough, fair enough. We have here more mausoleums. Danger subsidence. Uh, okay, I will try to avoid standing on that in case it collapses. Seems like a uh, not the best plan. I'll probably just collapsing slowly. I'm sure, there's nothing no immediate danger to worry about. Uh, we have another crypt down here that I can't get in. It's uh, quite firmly sealed. And uh, some hearses. Is there a stable somewhere for the horses? Horses pulling hearses. Oh. Doesn't appear that I'm going to find much enlightenment here in the cemetery. But uh, do I have any other... Do I have any other, uh, what's the word, areas to explore? I did just remember I have a shovel. So, well, you know, I could try digging up some of these old graves here. Um, seems a little pointless. I wonder if digging here might reveal why the ground is collapsing. Uh, yes, I did, did say it was risky, didn't I? Collapsing because there's a, uh, a tomb underneath that was uh, not adequately reinforced. Well, uh, at least I didn't injure myself. That uh, could have been quite dangerous. Oh, and uh, there's been more collapsing going on. This poor fellow's come out of his coffin entirely. There's a... Uh, I wonder what's been digging these tunnels. I don't know. Well, this just takes us back to the another part of the cemetery, I think. Ah, oh, excellent. I wonder how you normally access this uh, circular, crypty sort of place here. Interesting. Ah, that must be the door, the entrance. Probably connects. Oh, it's a big circular room we're in. I guess the passage down there, no doubt, connects through to the other part, half of the cemetery we're in. Someone put up danger signs here as well, so I guess this collapsing has been happening in many places. Can I. Oh. Right, I'll go the long way around. Oh, I can come down this, down this ramp. Perfect. 
So, maybe maybe one of the spirits is also trapped in here. That would uh, be an excellent reason for fate to have guided me in this direction. That's a window. Hmm, it is. Uh, it's an older crypt. Very dark. Uh, interesting. I'll have a look there in a minute, but uh, first let's <laughs> just finish exploring here, see if there's anything else at the end of this. Oh, it's our little doll friend. She went for a wonder all the way here. You know, really. You uh, should have stayed in the house, sir. Uh, look, you've got your dress all covered in dirt and your face is all dirty. You would have been much better off staying inside. I think I can hear another one of these uh, spirit friends. Yeah. Just have to go quietly. Because at the moment I don't have any way out of here that I can lead in. I don't really want to guess his intention until such time as I can lead him safely to the chapel. The uh, previous one that attacked me uh, hurt quite a lot and uh, getting injured is not really uh, why I got into this business. Where's the way out? Possibly up this way. Make sure we stay out of his uh, vision. Stairs up. Oh, just a side chamber. Oh, crouch, just in case he might see over that. Ah. This is what I need, I think. Does this lead back to the rest of the cemetery? Try that again. Indeed it does. So from here, if I run over to that corner, I should be able to lead this fellow straight back to the chapel. Excellent. All right, let's go, let's go fetch him and uh, bring him with us. This is the fourth or fifth? Ow! Oh, he was quick off the draw there. Ouch. I might have to use another. Quiet! God, you're noisy. I can't even hear myself think anymore. Oh, I might have to use another first aid kit. Right. Oh, these stairs are nearly invisible. Oh, that's okay. Yeah. Get stuck on the door. Ouch, again. Alright. Where's my first aid kit? Oh, worry about it later. No time to be fun fumbling with bandages while this noisy fellow is right on my footsteps. Through the only one. Ah, there we are. Oh, that was the fifth. Well, that's all five of them uh, at rest. Uh, it appears that five rest of the spirits from the mortuary complex put them to rest. Return to the entrance once your tasks are completed. 
I guess we have uh, solved the problem. Interesting. I do want to take a look at um, where are we? Ah, the room where the last one was standing there. At least wonder. Have to take a look at the fountain and see what it was about the fountain that so attracted his attention. Another side room, yes. Well, I have banished the five ghosts. Uh, I should say restless spirit. They don't really like to be called ghosts so much. It is just a rather ordinary fountain after all. So uh, that is the task that I was hired to complete. Um, the body of the gentleman at the foot of the stairs in the wine cellar is a little concerning, but uh, he does not appear to be haunting the place at least, so that should be one less problem. So I guess I can now return to the gate and collect my payment tomorrow. That'll be good. Uh, oh, the lights are on in the house. Did I do that? I don't remember turning all of them on. Oh, it uh, definitely seems brighter than it was before. And strange whisperings have gone. Uh, all the chairs have returned to their normal positions. Well, except the one that was knocked over. Yeah, it does appear that uh, the job is complete. I should probably go uh, tell him sooner than uh, tomorrow, right? Not this way. Um, I should return this UV lamp. I don't think I will have need of it anymore. I don't want to be accused of theft. Good, you've uh, come back here where you should be. Alright. Oh, I can't put it down. Never mind. Uh, I will take a souvenir with me. I'll return it uh, when I get my payment, but uh, for the moment it will be... Uh, Give me something to do on the long cold walk home. I can bounce the ball down the street as I walk. Well. Uh, mystery of Rose Cottage was not so terribly mysterious after all. Steal my ball. Thank you. Uh, and I hope I can find a cab at this time. Right, well, that was Rose Cottage. Uh, two hours, six minutes, 57 seconds, plus about a half hour's worth of uh, reloading, I guess. Oh, maybe not quite so much. Uh, Demi second 23. Yeah, got caught a few more times than I wanted. Uh, well, that was actually quite a large and sprawling mission, but uh, that was a little too. I don't know. Uninvolved. Lots of walking from one place to the next in an almost entirely linear order. And they're just hunting for the next item to let you proceed. Uh, and I couldn't even pick up everything that was lying around and throw it around the room uh, for my own entertainment while doing so. 
But never mind. Uh, that's Rose Cottage. Thanks very much for watching. And I will see you soon for the next mission.